Friends, we are going to do the experiment lightning in a test tube. Before we begin, please subscribe to my channel. I actually want your suggestions regarding making new videos and also to make a platform in Facebook and WhatsApp. Let us begin with the experiment. Lightning in a test tube is the classical description given for the highly oxidizing reaction of manganese heptoxide. We just need three substances for this demonstration. One is the concentrated sulfuric acid. Another one is the alcohol. Here I am using methylated spirit that is 95% ethyl alcohol. You can also use isopropyl alcohol if you want. And the third substance I am using is potassium permanganate crystals. Step one is to take concentrated sulfuric acid in the test tube. It should be the bottom layer of the test tube. The next step is to add the alcohol into the test tube. We should be careful that sul the sulfuric acid and the alcohol should not get mixed together. So we are pouring down the alcohol very slowly so that it forms a separate layer above the acid. You can see that a separate layer is being formed above the sulfuric acid layer and that is the alcohol layer. The third step is to add the crystalline potassium permanganate into the test tube. You can see the potassium permanganate has passed down the alcohol and started to react with the acid. Here I have put off the lights so that the reaction will become much more interesting. Here you can see the vigorous reaction has already started taking place and you can see flashes of light and it in the darkness it seems like lightning and hence the name lightning in the test tube. You can actually see that this reaction is very vigorous and you can see that the products in the test tube are actually rising up and too much of fume is also being produced and you can also see that flashes of light that means not all the potassium permanganate has been reacted with the sulfuric acid and it's still being going on. The chemistry behind this experiment was manganese heptoxide which is a very strong oxidizing agent and it oxidized the alcohol. Manganese heptoxide has plus 7 oxidation state and it itself got reduced to manganese dioxide with plus 4 oxidation state. Plenty of oxygen gas was produced by this reaction and the oxygen gas got lighted up in the presence of heat and alcohol. This is an exothermic reaction, so we should do this experiment either in a fume hood or outside.